I have always said the moment you see the HCL, seconds later you will see the new exchange rate. We don't see the budget in the Gazette. We have not had a single word from Parliament. Parliament said it was to be sent to be published in the Gazette. Firefly, a lack said Iraq returning to the glory days and it will surpass those days. Frank, this caught me off guard. They're talking to them a lot. We told you they would. They're releasing the videos. We told you they would. Alak is telling the people. Look, I got a mechanism. You know what it is. It's a new exchange rate. Iraq is returning to the glory day dot 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 and will surpass those glory days. I told you, you would never see one to one. There's a reason they kept it at 1310 and they're going to return back to the glory days which was $3.22 because this is an re reinstatement. IMO this is happening. Prime Minister Mohammed Shia Al Sudani confirmed today, Sunday, that Iraq's interest in developing gas projects will provide job opportunities and give the economy added value. The Sudanese media office said in a statement received by Al Farat News, that the latter received the CEO of the Chinese Petrogena Company in the Middle East, Dai Haoyang, and his accompanying delegation while stressing the keenness to develop relations with China in all fields, and that the presence of Chinese companies in various sectors, including the oil sector, this trend reinforces the development of relations between the two countries. He pointed out the associated gas project that was inaugurated yesterday in Mazen Governorate and which is being implemented by Petrogena is considered one of the strategic projects between the two countries as it falls within the government's priorities in stopping the waste represented by burning gas, expressing his thanks for the efforts of all those working in this project. The Prime Minister explained Iraq's interest in developing gas projects as part of the government's program to develop the manufacturing and fertilizer industries which will give the economy added value and provide job opportunities, and that there are sites that will be offered to companies, especially Petrogena, stressing the project offer, integrated energy implementation, which includes oil and associated gas production, processing plants, a power plant, and a petrochemical refinery.